forward. David Desmarest, Desmarest, David Desmarest, born of Huguenot parents in Picardy, France. Sorry for my pronunciation here. With his wife, Marie Sokir, and their sons, Jean, David, and Samuel, and their infant daughter, Marie, sailing from Amsterdam on the vessel. Bonico arrived in New Amsterdam, April 16, 1663. The family name from earliest time in this country was generally written Demarest. After two years on Staten Island and 12 and one half years at New Harlem, David Demarest bought from the Indians indenture of Sir George Carter, Lord Proprietor of the Province of East Jersey, large tract of land on the Hackensack River and made his home there. On that land, many of his descendants of the Demarest name and of other names are living today. In the nearby country and throughout the United States, the name has greatly multiplied. It has seemed desirable and important, therefore, that records should be compiled, making clear and making permanently available such facts as might be assembled concerning the life, the forebears, and the descendants of David Desmarest, a man very significant in the making of our commonwealth. Some story of it all was told 50 years ago by the Reverend Dr. David D. Demarest of the eighth generation in his The Huguenots on the Hackensack, a published address setting forth the valuable results of his original and painstaking research. That story has been the source and the inspiration of this enlarged study this expanded family record. It seems impossible to trace the family line in the old world with sure accuracy and adequate detail. The name runs far back. Incompetent students have given the ample results of their researches and close connection of David Desmarest with known families of his migration time is reasonably clear. The descendants in America in the recent generations are so numerous and they are so widely scattered that complete record of them is impossible. It has not been possible to attempt an entire tracing or to secure full information where tracing has been attempted. The male lines are given reasonably complete through the early generations are largely early generations and are largely developed down to the present day. The female lines are generally not extended beyond the immediate children. A great number of Demarest families of the present day, however, have not become known to this record. The family name carries on in various forms, additional to Desmarets. Desmarest and Demarest. Demarest. It is somewhere. It is somewhere. Demarest, or Demarest, or Demaray, in especially frequent form in the South and Middle West is Demarie. It differs sometimes among the members of an immediate family, and even in the usage of one person. In this record. No consistency of form is forced. The form of any signature or record is generally preserved, changed in some instances of minor importance or plain mistake in writing. The given names also appear in diverse forms. There is not only some near difference of spelling but as well as the difference of language form. French forms tend quickly to give place to Dutch. 
the name the given names also then are not forced into uniformity the glossary will make clear the variances and the correspondences the records of the early time it will be noticed often give date of baptism without date of birth baptism usually was within two weeks after birth until recent generations a son quite customarily took as a middle initial in his name the initial letter of his father's name this record inevitably does not in many individual instances conform to the actual use or omitting of such middle initial the record is not only far from complete but as well here and there inaccurate no doubt data received from different sources have not always been in full agreement names and dates in family bibles church records and burying grounds sometimes do not correspond in some instances this record gives alternative names or dates some errors there are okay some errors there are no doubt due to not quite correct information coming from the source depends depended upon or to the difficult form in which the information has come others may be the fault of the compilers in copying or proofreading of such a mass of names and dates it is proposed that the copies of this published book be numbered and that the possession of each be known if possible in order that pages of substantial corrections or additions received may be sent in due time to each possessor of the book to the specific genealogy an appendix adds much related material both narrative and documentary while much assembled material of substantial interest is excluded by the ne the necessary limits of the book the generous assistance given the compilers in the preparation of the record is gratefully acknowledged it is impossible to name all those who have thus shared in the work it would be difficult to select those who have been greater contributors than others. It is at least proper to mention Mr. Sheldon Demarest, Tilt of Warwick, New York, who allowed full access to the abundant material assembled by him in past years, and the Reverend Victor Barr Demarie of Hedrick, Iowa, whose recent inquiries, persistent and far-reaching in the Middle West, have been a great service. It is an agreeable incident of the record that it, that it appears on the 275th anniversary of the coming of the Pioneer family. Mary A. Demers, WHS Demers. New Brunswick, New Jersey, April, April 16th, 1938. <clears throat> Contents. Narrative. First generation. Second generation. Third generation. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Seventh. Eighth. Ninth. Families not fully traced. Earliest church records in America. Earliest civil records in America. Excerpt, ec, excerpts 
from history of Harlem, land purchase on the Hackensack, acts of council in early land transactions, early houses, wheels of earliest generations, Conewago, Ruago, Kentucky, and beyond, Reverend John Demarest and Major Andre, war records, the name in Jesuit missions, coats of arms, the name in past time France, French church records in England, the Desmarets family in England, the Desmarets family of Cambrai, and then the index. And I'll read the narrative another time. I haven't been getting much sleep. Leaning against this bed, messes with the back. At times I want to wrap it up when I read, but I have to read this very slowly. So, until next time.